Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's JD. And before we get started, I just wanted to let you know that this episode of Run JD Run is being sponsored by Loot Crate, the monthly subscription service for epic geek gamer items and pop culture gear. All right, let's do this. Hello, everybody. It's your boy, J. Dot. Wait, wait a minute. What the fuck is this motherfucker in front of me? <laughs> Get your, what, the, what the hell are you wearing? What's Zoo? Hey, what up, J. Doggy? What up, pal? Zoo, what are you wearing? J. Doggy, I'm just wearing the tightest threads from this side of the tip towel. Zoo, you look like a goddamn... You know what? I ain't even gonna speak on it. I'm gonna just let you do you, Zoo. Hey, thank you, J. Doggy. I appreciate it, man. <laughs> Yo, what up, everybody? <laughs> what up, JD here? Yes. J. Doggy Poo. Is back for 2016, bitches. Um, yeah. So I just, I was just, <laughs> I was just looking through my games, and I was like, oh, Dragon Ball. I'm in the mood. So yeah, let's do this. Um, gonna run through some parallel quests, have a little fun. You see, I got the Mr. Popo outfit on. Got to you know, shout out, shout outs to my Popo sister. Shout out to my L A L. Don't save her. She don't wanna be saved, Mr. Popo. He don't wanna be. All right, I don't know what I'm talking about. Um, who's my mentor? I think it's Cell right now. Uh, so probably got to play Perfect. Oh, Purple Perfect Cell. True power. Um, what up, y'all? Oh man, Trunks, it's been so long, bro. <laughs> Do they have the future Trunks? Trunks? Oh, yeah, that's my boy right here. Uh, what's up, guys and girls, humanoids and yeah, other things? How how is everything going? So I'm back. I'm Super 17, the ultimate android. All right, so we are here to play. I just wanted to play some Xenovest. It's been a while. I honestly kind of forgot the controls. Um, thought I'd have some fun, mess around in this game a little bit. If I, if I, God, God, he looks so ridiculous in this outfit. I don't know why I put this on him. Do I remember how to play? Do, uh, back, hold on. Yo, J. Donkey Poo's getting exposed! Damn it, Janie! Remember the controls, friend! Remember! Yeah, yeah. I'm sorry, J. Donkey Poo. I'm trying. You suck at this game, J. Day. Oh, there it is. Uh, J. Day. <laughs> uh, there it is. That word, boy. Um, But yes, oh my god, Birder. Get up off me, homie. Damn. That word! Oh, shit. Messed up. Sweet! Uh. Oh, what? So yeah, uh, hello. How are you? What's your, how's your, how's your, how's your Saturday? How's your Saturday? Did you get you, did you have some cereal? How, how was the cereal? Did you enjoy it? What kind of cereal was it, Timmy? Timmy? Did you have your cinnamon toast crunchies? Did you, did you crunch? Yes, ma, I might have cinnamon toast crunchies. <laughs> Oh uh, god, anybody who what cereal did you guys have? Leave in the comments below what cereal you, you ate this Saturday. Does anybody still watch Saturday morning cartoons? Is that a thing anymore? Or do the like I remember I think the only cartoon I still watch is I mean I watch a bunch of cartoons, but I'm just saying the ones that are on Saturday mornings, I don't watch any on Sat Whoa! That boy Batista bombed me, boy. I'm about to transform on that ass. Oh, and I have the turban. Boy, you don't want this super command man. Ah, a slight word. I don't even know who I'm shooting right now. Oh, Jesse. What was I gonna say though? Yeah. You guys still do that? Is that a thing? Any any kids in the in the in the comments who like wake up on Saturday morning excited for whatever? I don't know. I used to be really excited to wake up on Saturday mornings early. It's so weird. Like as an adult, I never I don't ever want to do that. <laughs> I never want to wake up early on any morning, actually, <laughs> but specifically Saturday. Saturday's like the day that like off, you know. Um, but yeah, leave your leave your delicious uh, your what's it called? Uh, what? Wow, it's getting weird. Uh, <laughs> it's a cereal. If you had cereal this morning, I don't even have any cereal. I throw mine all out. I, I get like I eat oatmeal. Oh, I'm so old. Oh God, you're so old, JD. Fucking shit. Pops, no, <laughs> shitty pops. Yo, I'm getting exposed in cell, and trunks aren't doing shit. Where are you guys? 
<laughs> sorry, sorry, boy. Well, <laughs> where are they? They're not even helping me. Why am I fighting Ginyu all, all by myself? Somebody. Like, seriously, I don't even know where they are. It's so weird. I'm looking at the screen. I don't see them. Oh, they're killing Raditz? What the fuck is this? What? Oh, it took y'all that long to kill Raditz, you garbage ass? Oh my god, where are we supposed to go? Oh, now we gotta fight. Now it's you know, my turn. I'm just gonna go ahead. All right, well, let me transform and give him that work. Oh, Super Kamehameha. Ah! Does anybody know if this game's getting a sequel this coming year, 2016? I've seen, like, what I think are legit, uh, legit what's it called for this game, but I'm not sure if it is legit, uh, what do you call it? Uh, not fan art, just, like, uh, wallpapers of the sequel, which would be Xenoverse 2, which to me would be really cool, because I'm trying to think, like, they would make their own brand new story up, which could be, it could be, a, oh god, it could be just so awesome, so amazing. Um, I need a. Uh, oops, no. How do you, how do you do it again? All energy capsule. Slight work. Uh, is that it? We probably got to go to. Oh, all right. I feel stronger than my character used to be. I got this. Or wait, should I let you attack? What? <laughs> oh, let's do this work. J. Jockey, who's the man for you? <laughs> Oh, man. Oh, you know what I want to talk about real quick? Uh, sorry to get off. Not, there's no topic. Just to talk. Listen to me, kids. Listen to me, adults. Listen to me, mid to upper late 40-year-olds who accidentally clicked on this video. Listen to me, senior citizens who might be friends of my grandma who are like, Check out my baby's YouTube page. Oh, it's so beautiful. Listen to me, all of you. There are rumors. There are goddamn speculations that that the game of all games might be coming out. What the this shit? Can I move? Okay, like I, I can't. Wow, he's not even flying. Um, there are rumblings, rumblings that Sonic Adventure Three might be happening. And I guess let's just head talk about Sonic. <laughs> um, so, I mean, people have already said Sonic Adventure 3 kind of already happened or that the production for it was planned, but it didn't it didn't go through 100 uh, percent. And I believe that was Sonic Unleashed. And obviously people, some people think like Sonic 06 sh was supposed to be. Uh, I mean, honestly, I think Sonic 06 was supposed to be Sonic Adventure 3, but they just they just, you know, <laughs> I, I, I don't know. Do I even have that game? I think I remember... Wait, was it on 360? I remember getting it for some console and then immediately taking it back. <laughs> but, um... Finish him with a super. Uh, whatever. There is rumbling. There are rumblings because this year is the 25th anniversary of Sonic. Sonic Team and all that. And, uh... There are rumblings that maybe Sonic Adventure... There might be, like, two different types of games. It's supposed to be one is supposed to be a platformer, like the original OG Sonic that's supposed to be coming back. And then there's there have been quite literally... It's not rumblings as much as, like, devs... Or not devs. What do you call them? Like, technical engineers for the game are sitting back saying, Yo, like, I think... I saw it on a YouTube channel. And it was saying that a guy who used to work for Sonic Team uh, in the American division, 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 or Sega, or whatever, I don't know what who he worked for. He said, we were working on this and that, blah, 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 this and this, bluesy blue. And he said one of them was a 3D world prototype, very reminiscent to Sonic Adventure 1 and 2. I guess they call it SA 1 and 2 now, uh, just to, I don't know, abbreviate it. And he said it was like six characters a hub world and a child garden and i was like that's sonic that's that's the one that's him jd <laughs> are you serious bro sonic you're here hi oh, man we're all here we've heard the rumblings <laughs> yeah man this is crazy i mean we really gonna come back like for real <laughs> oh 
oh my goodness, doll. I'm so excited. <laughs> All right, enough of that. Um, JD, we'll be back. Start Sonic Adventure 2 already, you bitch. Shut up, Sonic. Yeah, bitch. When tell Whoa, I didn't know you could move the background. And tell everybody to come to San Francisco. All right. There's no need to introduce myself. <laughs> um, because so yeah, Sonic die. Adventure 3. You know, you do we need it? Which begs the question. I guess is the question. I'm kind of content with what we have. I feel like Sonic Adventure 1 and 2 were very uh, well produced, well made. I think Sonic Adventure 1 is my favorite, honestly, because I think I like the hub world more than I did uh, the team aspect of Sonic Adventure 2 with Shadow's team and Sonic's team. But I'm not, you know, I'm not against it. If a third one came and it was the right type of Sonic, like it was, you know, accurate. And it played like Sonic Adventure 1 and 2 and maybe they fixed the camera. That would be great. I mean, I don't even know what... I, I mean, like, really, I can't even... Why is that game so so awesome to people, you know? I can't put my finger on it. I think it was because... I mean, we had had... There were 3D versions of Sonic before that. But that was... That felt like the first, like, fully flushed out 3D Sonic in the sense of, you know what it was? It felt like, uh, for Sonic, it felt like Super Mario, uh, Mario's, uh, Super, Mar oh my god, Mario 64. That's what Sonic Adventure 1 was. It was the Mario 64 of the Dreamcast for Sonic, in my personal opinion. Um, so now I'm just sitting back thinking about it, I'm just like, man, man, that'd be sick if we got Sonic Adventure 3, but what would it be? I mean, I, I know there. I know Sonic 06 happened. I know that character Silver was a part of it. I honestly don't know anything about him. I d I hardly played that game. There was too much. Um, what was wrong with that game? Maybe we should do an episode of it so I can see what the problem was. Cause in the back of my head, I can't really. I can't. I'm not exactly sure what the big the the biggest issue was. Except for like, I didn't like. Um, I wasn't a huge fan of all the traveling. That that uh ensued in that game there was a lot of like a lot of like weird hub world traveling and just felt broken something about the game was just like super broken to me but i mean i, I didn't give it a chance <laughs> i watched game grumps play it i thought that was cool <laughs> but i was like oh yeah no way i'm putting my time into this i remember i did want to beat it though there was a time where i was like oh i'm about to play this i never got around to it maybe we'll stream it <laughs> maybe we'll stream it <laughs> Oh god. Um Why is I, Super 17 still not dead? New support character. What the hell? Goku from GT. What is this mission? It's pretty tight. Um but yeah. I really want to know what you guys think in the comments below. Let's see if we can get a discussion going. Uh how do you how like first off, do you believe the rumors? Secondly, if the rumors were to be true, would you be happy? Would you be disappointed? What what are your feelings if we got a new Sonic Adventure or any new Sonic game, you know? I think it's been a whole year, and, like, according to people who are really big fans of Sonic, I guess the franchise doesn't go longer than, like, 12 months without uh, a new updated something. I guess we got... Was Sonic Boom last year? I guess it was. Yeah, I guess so. But, I mean, I don't know. And the people... I remember when I thought Sonic Boom was going to be tight. But, like... People say that Sonic Boom wasn't made by Sonic Team. It was made by other people. So, you know, whatever. We'll put the we'll put the blame on them. Um, yeah, this video's gotten really Sonic-y. <laughs> I should have just played Sonic. Oh man, I don't have like a Sonic game to play like a one-off though. But it's cool. Dragon Ball, it's here. <laughs> um, yeah. Give me that work or give him that work. Uh, am I hit? Am I? I don't even know where he's at. There he is. Uh, yeah, y'all. Sonic Adventure 3. I think my only issue is, I mean, I'm a Sonic fan, but I'm not a Sonic, like, I don't know the lore as well as I should. I don't know, like, the to the, the Tori. I don't know the storyline as much as, as well as I should. I know what I played as a kid. I remember all the games. I mean, I remember playing Sonic, you know, 1 through 3 on Genesis and then playing Sonic and Knuckles and then... I think, you know, there were some weird 3D games on the Sega Saturn that I touched on. And then I got the Dreamcast. That's when I got into Sonic Adventure 1. Sonic Adventure 2. Very enjoyable time in my life. 
And then after that, I kind of just dropped it. I should have ultimate finished him. Um, that was when it all ended for me. Ended, uh oh, there's more. Two minutes to finish this dude? Are you serious? Oh, we got to go to work. Now he's purple. Oh, God. If his life bar is dumbass. Oh, my God. What, Goku? You bouncing? Oh, you bitch. <laughs> he's got to come back as Super Saiyan level four. I'm about to say. I'm about to say you a bitch, Goku. Yo, I'm getting ex exposed right now. What the fuck? Oh, there we go. Z capsule. I was on the wrong thing. Um, What was I going to say? Okay, so when it comes to Sonic, I don't know much about any of the games after Sonic Adventure 2. I know that there was Sonic fuck heroes sonic heroes where i think it was like the three player thing and then sonic uh unleashed which people say was i mean not people but it's like in some sort of book that it was originally written off to be sonic adventure 3 not that that game is it but that's where they that's what they originally wanted to go with the idea but then out of nowhere they went completely left and changed the game in a drastic way and it, and it wasn't Sonic Adventure 3 but then I watched like a video the other day I think it was on Game Explain where all Sonic games that kind of came up after Sonic Adventure 2 had like the title of Sonic Adventure 3 on them regardless of if they were going to be them or not it was just one of those things where they just kind of is that lag or what <laughs> it was just one of those things where they kind of wrote them off like oh this might be sonic adventure 3 so they just wrote that into the uh the title of all the games after like you know not the title but the uh the uh the, the placeholder names for the games so i don't know i don't know guys if sonic adventure 3 happens would i be happy yes i have no idea what the storyline would be but i i did i do not care uh it, i just don't care you know it would just be one of those things where like if it happens hell yeah if it doesn't happen whatever it's cool um, we really need to finish this guy. 42 seconds, y'all. I need a charge. Charge, charge. Okay. Um, and then I guess a new platformer game where I think somebody said it's supposed to be like the origin of chaos or something or the chaos emeralds. I don't know anything about that, but I, all right, we got to kill this dude. Come on. One more hit. Finish him. Uh, I want it. Hell yeah. Um, I think that could be fun. You know, just, uh, yeah. Yes, well nice. Quite entertaining. Keep Pretty good. good work. I got pans clothes. Hell yeah. Evasive skill dragon burn. All right. I mean, I, just from a Sonic fanboy perspective, this whole episode became about Sonic. <laughs> I'd love to see that. Um, Yeah, well, that's that. That was a fun little parallel quest. It actually that went longer than I expected. I thought I was going to do two, but I think one is fine. Uh, let me know what you guys think in the comments below um, about <laughs> Sonic. <laughs> Completely irrelevant to this video. But thank you all for watching. If you enjoyed it, be sure to hit that like button. Uh, share. Links in the description below. And don't forget to subscribe. And also uh, stay tuned because after the end credits, I will have some more info on Loot Crate. Because this episode is sponsored by it. Thanks again, everybody. I really appreciate it. Have a nice day. I'll catch you on the next video. Uh, yeah. See you later. Peace. Hey, everybody. Thanks again for watching this episode of Run, JD Run. And don't forget, the Loot Crate box coming this month is called Invasion. And it celebrates what's best about otherworldly intrusions, mysterious monsters, eerie extraterrestrials, and the heroic humans who stand stalwart in the face of overwhelming odds. Uh, that was a mouthful. But yeah, it'll be filled with exclusive items from X-Files, Alien, The Fifth Element, Space Invaders, and a bunch of other sci-fi goodies. You guys should be on the lookout for this month's box. If you want to get your own Loot Crate box and get 10% off, be sure to sign up at LootCrate.com slash RunJDRun and enter the code RunJD to save that 10%, people. All right? Appreciate you. Thank you for checking out this episode, and I'll catch you on the next one. Peace.